guys i thought i'd give you a quick update on my hair as you can see my hair has calmed down a lot and um, i chopped off like literally one inch of my hair i'll show you the back i was researching about capillary schedule i think that's how you say it okay so what that means is you put your hair type in, what's your hair type, low porosity, high porosity, medium, and how your hair is, is it dry, is it normal, is it oily, and you put all that in and it will tell you what kind of hair type you have or what kind of hair nourishment, hydration it needs. So um, it const as far as I understand, okay, you can research about it and look online. Um, there are three categories which comes under it so one is hydration so you are hydrate your hair then you have nourishment then you have reconstruction i think so those are three main points so when there was an app and i will put down a link below not to the app to the video which i came across when i was looking for my hair type how to reduce my frizz and everything for a hydration mask i looked on this app and the app says one ripe avocado and one tablespoon of castor oil so what i'm gonna do i'm gonna put it in this blender and mix it all together and i will show you i'm having a hard time blending this it's not blending at all so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna add some water you know i love my water i could easily blend it with um adding some water so it looks very creamy consistency like conditioner like consistency we're gonna talk about how we are going to apply this mask to our hair. So first you're gonna do, you're gonna shampoo your hair, get all the dirt out from your hair. After you shampooed and wash all the shampoo off your, off your hair, off of your hair, okay? Squeeze the water out from both sides of the hair. After you squeezed all the water out of your hair, you're gonna get the mask and apply to your, to your root, to your tip. So all over your hair, okay? Leave it in your hair for 20 minutes. Wrap it up in a cling film wrap your hair up in a shower cap as well so put all your hair in a shower cap the only thing we do in is you don't want the water with leftover water to drip down all over you so in the meantime you can wash your body so if you're in a shower wash your hair first get all the shampoo out and put the mask on then wash your body then wash out your mask then you condition your hair as well this is a mask so leave your mask on for 20 minutes and wash it off with normal water and apply conditioner to your hair and wash that off as well. I've never done it this way before because I always applied masks in my hair when it's dry. After I do this method, I will come back and show you how my hair is doing in two days time so you get to see how my hair is doing and if it's any good or bad or anything like that. Since I started loving my hair again, the hair journey, my hair is looking better i would say less frizzier than normal so if you look at my my second video uh, or my first video you can see how much my hair is gone gotten better it looks a lot more healthier a lot more volume a lot more thicker i do not know is it because of the frizziness of my hair or just getting better or worse i don't know hopefully it's getting better because i'm giving it all the love again if you want to follow my hair journey please do and I will put down the link in the description below of my all my previous video if you want to have a go and watch my video just for fun or if you feel like oh someone else is thinking of doing something and uh, I will see you guys after two days then. I want to do a quick update on my hair after putting the avocado and castor oil in. Okay, so you can see this really has helped my hair if you see still hasn't dried completely i haven't used anything but if you noticed at my scalp it's a little bit oily so what i would recommend to you guys is instead of putting the mask all over your hair after you shampooed i would say just put from like near the roots to the end but if you can see the curls are really nicely like look at those curls so, test this one out 
if you are a curly girl or if you got curly or wavy hair, definitely test mask out after shampooing and before conditioning. So shampoo, mask, leave the mask in for 15-20 minutes, wash it off, condition, wash it off, you're good to go. You can either add a leave-in conditioner like soon after you came out when your hair is still a little bit wet or you can add oils and i'll put down a link in the description of the video i recently saw as well and one of my friends sent it to me and she talks about how you have different kind of hair so you have penetrating hair where it penetrates into your cuticles and you have sitting on hair which seals the cuticles so the moisture won't be lost if that makes sense and uh, yeah i think my hair is a little bit on the oilier side but i'll give it after two days just to see how it how it is doing by the way i'm back as you can see my scalp has become extremely oily but it's still frizzy at the end but not much as it was before so it's oily from there up to here i would say same as here you can see look oily from there to here but rest of my hair is normal and it's fine if you seen my hair soon after i washed it my curls were really nice and really defined comparatively usually my hair is like a lot of frizz i would probably not put a oiled mask into the scalp if i was just using avocado on its own avocado on its own I would probably put it on the scalp because I added castor oil and made my hair extremely oily in the scalp. It's not the oil from my scalp, it's just the castor oil which is stuck in my hair. I would recommend you guys go and search about hair porosity, capillary schedule. If you want to try them, please do. If you want your curls popping, I would say find out what your hair type is and how you should apply the mask. I'm gonna try a couple of masks probably the next two few weeks. If you haven't seen my other videos, please do check it out and see why I'm doing this. There are one to four weeks available for you guys to watch. And I will see you guys next week with another mask. I'll let you guys know anything new I find as well. Be safe, be healthy, and I will see you guys next week. Bye!